Hi, my name is Andrew Nalan. I'm here to talk about my entry in this year's Doug Moran National Portrait Prize. I've been selected as one of the 30 finalists. Uh, so, my painting's entitled What? Um, and I just like to give an explanation as to any meanings behind the painting. This painting behind me is actually entitled Christmas. Um, it's because I'm a fan of McCubbin and I don't really like Christmas. But uh, you can actually view the painting uh, entitled What? Uh, as part of the exhibition that's held at uh, Juniper Hall in Sydney. So the painting's uh, deliberately ambiguous in nature um, because it's a, it's a commentary on um, misuse, misunderstanding of images in today's society uh, more often than uh, in the past. Um, so when you look at the painting, well, there's a number of things that you might um, decide about it. So you might you look at it and say, is it is it a severed head? Is the person who portrayed are they a serial killer? Are they just someone who's had a bad day and the, you know, the chicken's head's fallen off and there's, there's a bit of blood on the wall or something? So that, that's part of the ambiguity. And so the, the point being is that um, there's a lot of images that are circulated that um, maybe in, in the meme culture and so forth that um, have meanings assigned to them um, that aren't necessarily what the original intentions are. And, and so that's the point of the image. Um, but it's, it still allows people to discuss what, what's going on, what are the intentions behind the image. So that, that's, it allows a dialogue to discuss um, what you see in other forums as well is, well, what, what really is the intention behind the image? Um, and, well, we, we all know where in today's world of disposable images, um, how it might be relevant. The, the image also incorporates sort of um, compositional and artistic features that are also designed to give it a, um, an ambiguity as well um, because the, the image is kind of off. Um, so it's, it's, not a, it's not a front on portrait, it's not a quarter turn, it's not a three quarter turn, it's all a bit skew -whiffed. So the proportions, uh, the tones used in the image uh, make, it, make the viewer, or hopefully make the viewer, a little unsettled um, besides the, the graphic content of the, of the image, but it also makes the viewer perhaps um, reconsider the image because of its nature of it's just not quite right. Um, and so that's, that's, that's sort of a, an, an intent that was deliberate um, just, just so that, you know, there's more to the image and either there's you know, potentially more to other images that people see. Um, how does it portray me as a self-portrait? Well, obviously um, the commentary of the image um, is not necessarily my personal life, but is views that I wish to express in art and therefore it reflects my personality. Um, so I hope that uh, the image can be a talking point at the very least um, and give people an understanding um, my perspective that there's, a, there's uh, a lot of a lot of images in in today's society that perhaps need to 
not be taken for granted. Um, particularly, we have people who label images with memes and so forth, where uh, it can be mass marketed or, or, or sent sent through the airwaves, and there's a, there's that meaning assigned to it, but um, perhaps that meaning is is not real. Perhaps, well. Perhaps it is real on one level, but then there's more underneath the surface that you can consider. So that's about it, really.